That is not a bank envelope, is it? No! <gasps> oh! Oh, there actually is money in here. Ooh, jewelry. Is that another bank envelope? Oh, yes, it is. I got the wallet. 18 round. That sounds like ammo. We'll kill you. It. We just paid 250 bucks for this storage unit right behind me. Why? My favorite thing to find? Video games. Full of video games. Her favorite thing to find? Shoes. Full of shoes. It's like this one was designed for us to get. Let's go in there and see what we got. One more reason I knew because of my brother, FL Studio is expensive music making software. So this guy's probably a musician of some sort. Let's start on the mystery side. I assume the praying hands were Tupac and that is exactly what it is. And we also see, that's dumb J. Cole, right? Yeah. So we've seen a few music posters to go along with the FL Studio software. So we kind of assumed there would also be music equipment on there. This is a Joker movie poster. I don't know what that's worth. It's folded up really bad, unfortunately. Okay, well, this is not shoes, but this is a pop filter for a microphone. So it does support our theory on music. And the rest of this, why do they have so many fast food forks and knives in here? You never know like where you're going to need them. I guess that's fair. Some screws and bolts, yeah. Random little pieces in there. Let's get that box over here. I want to pull these cushions away because I want to know what's under them. Let's see, is that a mat? I don't even know. Uh, Looks like yeah, a futon, futon thing. thing. Yeah, futon. that's what I was about to say. Let's see what's down here. Well, <laughs> cereal. No cereal and ramen. Make sure Come it on. is cereal in there. Oh yeah, it's, let's see. Yeah, you can kind of smell it. Okay. That's not allowed to be stored. It's illegal actually, you know that, to store food in a storage unit, but pretty much everyone we get still does it. You know what else should be illegal? Huh. When it's 95 degrees outside, you don't have to match that on the inside. It's like 95 and daylight. That's really It's hot. all good. I can feel that now. When I saw the pictures, I was like, that bag looks like it's full of shoes and I'm touching it. I'm almost confident that bag's full of shoes. Look at this little jacket here. Nice little dickies. I'm gonna reach in a couple <laughs> of these pockets to see if I can find anything right here. Oh, there. You worked There's at Kroger. Name, yeah. <laughs> worked at Kroger. We'll set that over here. What about this bag? Oh, more shoes, shoes already. Let's go. Because we're starting in the Air Force Ones. Look at that. Nice. Nice. They're pretty clean too. They, you can tell he takes care of them. Bottoms, obviously they're worn, they're white, they attract dirt. Is that another pair right here? Is that another one? Yeah. These got the tan bottoms instead. Check that out. That's a good start. That's a good start. There's one more pair of shoes in here too. And that is another pair A Nike. Man, three right out the first bag. This is absolutely no time for laziness, but I have to give you points for creativity. With I, I thought this was pretty good. You can feel the lice in it. 250 might sound like a lot, but usually if you see one shoe, it's gonna go for like $8 billion. I don't know why. These are kind of beat up, but still they're in there. This has a tag on it real quick. Is this even like a real brand? What are these? Ooh, Adidas. Are they? Oh, they are Adidas right there. But they have this little tag on them. Are they real Adidas? Yeah, maybe we should scan that barcode and see what comes up. I hope I don't melt here, but I put in the number inside the shoe into eBay and I'm getting different color combinations pre-owned. They're selling as low as 17 bucks and as high as 50 bucks, but we're getting different color combos. And plus these are brand new. So I'd imagine that's probably $50 at least. I see myself withering away. <laughs> I'm melting one sweat <laughs> droplet at a time. <laughs> Let's put that over here. A couple bucks at a yard sale. Then we got some Fila shoes. We got some, let's see, more Adidas that are in really good shape actually right there. These right here, another pair of Adidas. Dude, really like the Adidas. Yeah. Right there. What about these? Adidas again, huh? A lot of Adidas. I'm so surprised how cheap this unit went. There's the other one of the new pair right there. Because usually, like I said, you see shoes and that's it. Usually they bid them up to like twice the retail price. There's some uh, more Adidas parlay right there. Another pair right here, Fila's. And then look at this. Look at this. I just want you to get a sense of how many shoes we're dealing with right here. This right here, easily more than we pay for the entire unit. So first thing I noticed when I look in this wardrobe bag here is the Fila tag, 25 bucks new with tag. So that is a good sign that there's gonna be a lot of clothes in here mixed in that's brand new. Some of them I'm seeing without tags, but I guarantee as we flip through, I can see more tags right here, look. Come here, a lot of these, they're from Marshall, so they're not gonna be really expensive, eight bucks. But look how many of these, this one right here is 32 bucks. A lot of these have tags on them. So I guarantee you this bag right here, is probably gonna be worth around 50 bucks or so. Just in the new clothes. The used stuff, we just donate, unless it's like jerseys or something. And again, right off the bat, look, as soon as you, what you're seeing, right off the bat, $25 Adidas shirts, no tag. But again, I'm seeing multiple tags. So I bet you another 50 bucks in just new clothes right there. These big black bags. Are we gonna see more of the same? These are heavier duty, but look, Forever, Forever 21, right off the bat, tags on them. That hoodie, no. 
this jacket is a Vans jacket actually. That's nice. And then that one's got a tag. It's Nike actually. So again, I mean, I'm saying those are jackets, even though there's not as many. I'd say close to 50 bucks on that one as well. Then we got this. Oh my gosh, look. Bag of shoes. That bag's full of shoes too. Let's look in here really quick. Yeah, open up. Let's see what we got going on in this bag. Anything else? No, these ones I'm not seeing no tags right now. Nope, never mind. Take it back. Look, new with tags right there. Again, probably $50 for that bag too. I'm going to guess this actually, that one's shoes as well. You want to go into the shoes? Yeah. Let's right see on. what shoes we got. Another pair. Or, uh, these, are, these are not Air Forces. These are wannabe Air Forces. They're Adidas though. <laughs> right there. In here. Ooh, look at those red ones. Those are clean Somebody right there. Somebody like Air Forces. Yeah. <laughs> Those are clean. And then we got that pair right there. And yeah, these brown like loafer type shoes. So we started bagging some pants. And again, I'm noticing right off the bat, look, Rolf Loring, new with tags, this fashion thing, new with tags. And what we're also noticing in the shirts, they're size small all the way to 2XL. So I'm wondering if our dude that owned this unit was also a reseller of some sort as well, or he got them by some other means, I don't know. So far, this unit seems like a Slam dunk. Something's telling me this bag right here is about to be interesting, but first, look in here. Nice more Adidas, some Reebok, Are these Nike, some Nikes. Look at the condition of those bottoms. I don't think they've been worn. And there's probably another solid, I mean, what do you think? Seven, eight pairs of shoes in this bag right here of all different brands. This unit is gonna be a home run. I always love book bags. They're always so interesting. Like this giant envelope right here full of cash, right? Right, who's this from? Uh, it doesn't say. But let's see what's inside of here. I gotta, I gotta check. Anything? No, just paperwork. That's boring. Let's see what's in the first zipper right here. Or actually, what's on the side? There's some stuff right here. Some rubber bands. Okay, some rubber bands and there's some little audio piece down here. It looks like that thing. A microphone or something? That. Let's go into this bag itself. Front zipper. It just looks like papers, 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 and papers, unfortunately. Let's just put that back in there. Uh, what about, is that money? Is that money? No, it's just receipts. All right, let's go to the main compartment here. What do you think is in there? Money? Yeah, cash. Keep, keep saying money, it might be money. Money? No. Oh, okay, I found rubber bands and now I'm finding sandwich baggies. This isn't a good look, not gonna lie. Uh, what else is in there? Just a pump and some masks? What about back here? Just more papers and uh, uh, NBA Live 05 for the PlayStation 2. Now that's a classic. Which tote do you like better? Smaller green or bigger gray? Green. Green? All right, let, oh, that's heavy. That's not close. No, that's definitely not close. Let's see what it is. Uh, I was about to say books, but I didn't want to. This has an address, ooh, an Acer, is that a monitor? Address on it. This is what? A birthday card with something in it, please? No, what about this one? There's a card in a card. Nothing in it, unfortunately. But there's the guy's name. That allows us to look him up. Nothing else in there. Oops, drop the card. There's some books, a Bible. Is there money in the Bible, <coughs> please? Aw, no. A couple books. Uh, What is that monster thing? You see that? The well, first, look, audio technician, headphones. Again, definitely supporting the music theory right now. This guy right here, what is this? Is that a speaker? I don't even know, a monster. It's just a monster. But I see master volumes, mic, guitar, so maybe it's some type of music piece as well. A lot of book, oh, what is that? That is not a bank envelope, is it? <gasps> oh, you hear that? I do hear that, I heard the choo choo choo. I just <laughs> might have found a bank envelope with cash in it. Let's see, GameStop bag? Uh, well, it's just pennies, but it's money, so now well, we hey. gotta, Let's see what else is in here. Uh, what else? Books, books, books. There's a binder here of some sort. What's in the binder? Cards? No. Uh, graduation stuff, personal stuff. We'll make sure they get back. A keyboard and just a lot of books. Oh, what's that? That's in there. Nothing. Really random to just find the pennies, but hey, I take money anytime. Now you can see this stack of video games in the pictures they posted online, but what you couldn't see, or you could kind of see if you knew what you're looking at, that M right there, that looked exactly like a PlayStation 2 case. So I'm hoping there's some old PS2 games and that's exactly what they are. First, let's see what this is. Modern Warfare 3, that's in there. 
South Park Stick of Truth, that's in there. Oh my gosh. If you never played this game right here, you are missing out. This is one of the best PlayStation 2 games of all time. Bully. All right, I'm just going to grab this bag now. Oh, yes. Right here. Bad Boys 2, or just Bad Boys for PlayStation 2. Max Payne, Nicktoons. All we need is one Def Jam New York City or one Tenkai E.T. 3 to be worth a ton. That uh, Monster House, Max Payne, Final Fantasy X, Assassin's Creed for PlayStation 3. We even have some PS4 in here. Kingdom Hearts. What about over here? God of War, NBA 2K21, Dead Island. Oh, yes. More PlayStation 3, LA Noir, and Batman. Now I'm seeing some DVDs. There's another PlayStation 2 in there. What about what else is under here? DVDs. Looks like we got some Martin. It looks like we have like the whole freaking set of Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine parts of the same book series. I bet you that's worth something too. Hey, you want a Logic album cover? Uh, sure. What was that? Did you <laughs> just hear something fall? I did. Okay, that's a little weird. That. Uh, let's see, Jay Cole, hey look, Virginia Beachopoly. Where in Virginia Beach, that's appropriate. That says games. Let's see if it's the case. Oh, it's board games. There's checkers, what's in there? Is it actually checkers? That's the question. Huh? It's dominoes and chess. This right here, that. Look at all these stickers. A lot of like the toy stores and stuff always have like piles of these at the front that you can pick out like, you know, two for a dollar or something like that. I was hoping to see some Dragon Ball in there, but I don't see it. Superman flipping me off, that's beautiful. <laughs> There's a little pug meme. A eh, bunch of randomness. Uno and randomness. We do have a microwave. Do we take the gamble and open it up? Yeah. Ah, you know what? Not for bad. storage unit, that is pretty clean. I'm happy with that. Easy 10 bucks. Let's see what's in the little red bag. And I want to see if FL Studio is in there. Because if this is in there, this software is worth a lot more than we paid for this unit. And it's not an empty box. So that's a good sign. This right here, what's in the red bag? Come here, come here, come here. Open up. Open. There's nothing in there. But the inside is where all the money's at, right? Right. Obviously. Let's see. Oh, there actually is money in here. A quarter. We got a quarter. <laughs> there was money in there. What is that? Oh, that's just a little bead thing. But hey, I found money in the bag. You did. And a bank envelope. FL Studio. Uh, let's see. This is just the box. You know what? And the booklet. This might seem like trash, but I guarantee, I bet you like a hundred bucks, Brandon's gonna want this for like display. Cause he's like super into music design and the, act, the physical software and stuff like that. So I bet you he will. What is this right here? Ew. Heat wrap. And then a bunch of bathroom stuff. Stomach relief, off-brand, off-brand Pepto doesn't do it like real Pepto. <laughs> Take it from me. You need the real stuff if you want to save yourself. I see more video games right here. Is that a phone? No, no, what is that? But that's empty. Let's see. That is nothing. I see more video games right here. Advanced Warfare, Call of Duty, Black Ops, Call of Duty, Black Ops. This is all Call of Duty, Call of Duty Ghosts. Skate 3, is that another bank envelope? I think I see another one. Hey look, Black Ops 2 in Modern Warfare 3. There's like a whole Call of Duty set right here, isn't it? Yep. Is that another bank envelope? Oh yes it is. Hey, beautiful. I like the shape of that. What, what's in there? Come on. Oh, just paper. Dang uh -huh. it. Nothing. Hey look, another pop filter for a microphone right there. Let's see if I can get this up here. Look, here's some cards. Are any of these, like, you know, no, they're actually his. These are DoorDash cards, <laughs> like for the driver to pick okay. it up from. Look at the microphone down here though. Look what I found. That looks nice, but it literally doesn't have a name on it, so I don't even know how to look it up. Mm -hmm. It's just a nice looking microphone. Okay, is this a cat toy? Is that, is it work? Does it work? No, it doesn't work. Dang it. That laser pointer. And yeah, nothing else in here besides just random junk. Up here, there's more shirts, and I can already tell you, there's a tag, there's tags coming out the top. I bet you, again, at least half of those. Newest tags, Nice. 50. This one right here, same thing. You can see the tags through the plastic. So I like how they're packaged. I know. Same with the one under it. And this one, oh, this one has a jersey on it, I think. We're we'll have to look at that. Let's get these out of here. Another probably hundred bucks right there. I see it looks like what looks like a jersey. Oh yeah, is this all jer these are all jerseys. Get oh. out of here. <laughs> get out of here. This unit is just epic, man. Alright, what is this one right here first? An Adidas. Okay. Shocker. Dude loves Adidas, doesn't he? Yeah. But just Bulldog, so just like a generic, not an actual player, obviously. But look through here. All right. This dude right here. Irving. Celtics. Let's see if we can get some good one. This can be a lot of money. Okay, this is getting on my nerves. It's catching every little hanger. There we go. This right here, who's this guy? Not just a Nike jersey. 
and uh, any more of sports jerseys. Well, this looks like a lot of sports clothes. Soccer. Look, tags, 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 tags on almost all of them down mm. there. Man, that's easily, like I said, probably a hundred bucks right there. You wanna go in here? Sure. Look, first thing we go into, look at the price of those pants. hundred bucks right there. I would never pay a hundred bucks for pants. Mm -hmm. Look, this one, tag on it right there. It's crazy how much new a tag this guy, new with tag this guy had. What about in here? Are these new with tags or do we finally get some like his clothes he actually wears maybe? Uh, I don't see tags on these. Maybe we finally found his stuff. I don't know what's up with all the new stuff, but you know what? It makes me happy. What about in here? Ooh, this one's random. Look at all the packs of masks. What? Ooh. You hear that? Let's see this. Ooh, jewelry. Look at that. I wonder if these are stamped gold. Let's pull it out. They're like little cross earrings. I don't see stamps on these, but look inside that container. There's quite a lot of those in there. That could definitely be gold. What about down here? More earrings. Maybe those are silver? Silver Maybe. and gold? That would be cool. In here, masks. Is that a wallet? I got the wallet. But dang it, there's nothing in there. Oh, all these masks, some cologne. What is this? Amazon Fire Stick. Some ammo. Oh, shotgun. Random, you know, little box of shotgun shell. Just falling out of it. That's nice. Hey, look, a USB Wi Fi adapter. We just bought one of those on Amazon. That's why it's funny. Down here, come out, come out. I'm just going to pull out one and see if it's new or not. Some champion, like track pants. I don't see new with tags, but you know, still good clothes. All the way down there, that's clothes. What about the bottom drawer? Again, clothes. Let's pull out one and see if we see tags. Nice jeans for sure, but <clears throat> no, I don't see any tags on these either. Let's go back to this side now. This bag right here seems to be a lot of clothes. Well, I don't see tags on these, so maybe these are just, you know, his dirty laundry. Cause they kind of smell. The other stuff smelled like good. That smells like clothes. Ooh, yeah. Look in here. I think I see a PlayStation game. Is this a tablet here? What the heck is that? It's got a webcam on it. It says it's a portal from Facebook. Look at that. Facebook makes like tablets now. I have no idea. Okay. Let's just get this whole thing out of here onto the cart really quick. Ugh. Okay. Let's see. Oh. There's that, nice. you know, 18 round mag. This right here, this is just bathroom stuff. All right, let's see. There's another, it's like the third pop filter we found. Is this a projector? We got us a projector as well. Now I'm starting to see PlayStation 4 games show up like Spider-Man and Kingdom Hearts. Oop, NBA 2K. Oh, there's Kingdom Hearts in there. Spider-Man, oh yeah. Finding games galore. Ooh, what, what's this? That sounds like ammo, I can't lie to you. It feels and sounds like ammo. Let's go to the main compartment here. 100%, <laughs> I knew. Nice box of nine millimeter right here. And then <clears throat> this one, nine millimeter as well. That's what that magazine goes to. So I mean, we found the ammo, we found the mag. You know what's left. Is it in here somewhere? Please. Hopefully. There's just some sheets, crayons. No smoking without that, <laughs> without me. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh. It does get kind of random down here. Don't, oh, look at, oh man. That probably would have been really nice and expensive. How do you take care of it? Every time. Yeah. Like we find one of the music things. Like They're always smashed. Yeah, these deodorant, these is deodorant, man. This dude lived and breathed deep. Oh, oh. These green bags. Oh my gosh. This, yeah, these got, this sounds like ammo. This sounds like money. But two of my favorite things, <laughs> might I add. Let's see. Is this one all money? Sounds like it for sure. It is, come out, come out. It's like twisted up galore. All pennies again, but still, Ew. money is money. This one right here is just ammo. Sounds like it's gonna be ammo. This <laughs> thing, I don't even know. These look like microphone pieces, maybe. So we'll put that down here. Graduation hat. What's this? Nothing. I see like a microphone box down here. I wonder if this is for our microphone we found earlier. Audio Technicia. Let's see. No, that one's in there. Look, nice little microphone right there. That's good money for sure. Now, anything else hidden down at the bottom of this box? I'm not seeing it right now. That definitely doesn't mean I haven't missed it. We'll let you know later on. If you haven't liked this video, what are you doing right now? You better leave it a thumbs up and you better subscribe if you're not already because we're always buying storage units. This picture we saw on the online posting. I thought it looked full of shoes. I felt it. It feels like shoes. I think we just open it and dump it and see what we got. All right. You think so? We just yep. put it back in. Oh my gosh. Okay. <sighs> Brand new right there nice mm, uh, i don't know if i'm gonna dump these these might all be new look adidas look new 
with tags right there. What about these? Vans? New? No. Mm, I'd say new. Yeah, I would. If not, worn maybe once. In oh, the house? <laughs> yeah, like no. Oh my gosh. This is full. Are these Nikes? <laughs> Those? Maybe once or twice. Let's dump it out. I can't do this. You ready? Come on, Max. Crap out money. Crapping money everywhere. Look at that. Nice. Man, hey. how many new pairs of shoes do we have in here? We have found a um, pair like that before. British Knights. Oh, these were expensive like too. Like a long they? time ago. I'm pretty sure these were like pretty costly. We got Nikes, like probably five, six pairs of Nikes. I mean, let's just like try to make sense of this really quick. There's a pair of Nikes. Uh, there's a pair of Nikes. This one right here, another pair of Nikes. This one and uh, I, I don't hey. know. We got them right there. I would say probably a solid 10 pairs of shoes with like seven out of the 10 being brand new. That bag alone pays for the unit easy. I think I've lost a solid 10 pounds here. This is a good workout for our team. Yeah. What do you think? Should we go under the bags or into the dresser? Uh, let's do dresser. Let's see. Okay, number one, hubcaps. One, Yay. two, full set of four. I really don't know what these go for. I don't know, like I always see cars with no hubcaps and like, I've never lost a hubcap. Like, I don't know how people will lose them. I don't know what happens. Like, maybe no. you got hitting curbs. <laughs> Top drawer. Ooh, yes. Look, look, look. Will kill you. It, it, yawn, open. Will kill you. Why is there a question mark? Like, it's like, will, will kill yawn, it, yawn, open. <laughs> okay, I'm opening it. Kill me. Aw, it's just cotton. Boring. What about one of these? No. No. Come on. This iPhone thing. What about this drawer? There's some more money. A little Sharpie, a little key, a little overpriced sticker, and some toothbrushes. Not too much. Ooh, a flash drive. That's going to my pocket because I like to look on those. Um, nothing else in there. What about the second one? Light bulbs? It, I wonder what all of these here are for. I really wonder what all that's for. Totally. Uh, what about here? Oh, nice. Baby blockers. Whole few boxes of baby blockers. What is this? Uh, hymns? Uh, what is this? <laughs> nope. I'm not going up further into that. Enough looking. More clothes here. More clothes. Yeah. Just clothes. Get, get in there. What about here? More clothes. Again, the ones in the drawer seem to be like not new, so maybe these are what he was actually wearing. Socks galore. And ugh, underwear. No, thank you. And... Oh, there's actually a bunch of new socks in there, but anything else? Look at all the new socks, actually. Nice. There's tons of them in there. Cool, so a bunch of new socks down there. More black bags over here. Do we have even more new clothes? Let's see. Uh, no, no, yeah, look at that. This is just insane. Dude is like an episode of Hoarders, you know? They're just like, <laughs> it's a good deal. We have to get it. We bought them all. We just stuck them in a storage unit. Where's, what's his name when you need it? Where's Matt Paxton? <laughs> Come clean this stuff up from hoarders. Uh, this is all new stuff again. Insanity right here. This, ooh, that looks like electronics. This right here, let's pull out one of these jackets. Come out, you. Uh, don't see a tag on this guy. So not sure if these guys are here gonna be new. But this one laying on the floor is new. There's a tag right there for 25 bucks. That's a good sign. I got you a basket. Oh, thank you. Yay. Let's take. This right here, ooh, I see gaming stuff. Where can I put this? Don't know. Out of places right now. Let's just do it right here. I'll just sit down here. Let's just go through it. This plug. <laughs> uh, I see a PlayStation gaming headset though. Look at that. PlayStation headset, little camera, handheld tripod. More headsets in here. Oh yeah, are there any cameras in here? There's lots of camera pieces. Oh my gosh, if you know what this is, you're an OG YouTuber. Everybody had this back in 2013. This is how you would um, convert your console gameplay to your PC to edit. I had two of these actually. Good days. There's some Beats by Dre in here. What, what is this? Are these like the little um, headphones? Or no, it's just the aux cable. But look in here, more audio equipment. I was hoping to find the game system, <laughs> but I don't see it in this bag at least. This bag has two heaters in it. Now I'd plug them up and test them, but I don't think I'd survive that. This right here, these are all shoes again. Man, look at this. Nike, 
these are i mean again brand new i don't un actually no they're not i thought that, that that looked like a tag right there but still really good shape nikes i mean we gotta have close to a hundred pairs of shoes in this unit right now before we tell you make sure you put a cat guess in the comments guess how many total pairs of shoes we have this is pull up bar little camera down there and the last thing we gotta figure out is this feels really really weird I don't have a knife. Yes, you do. Oh, it's on the keychain. Where's the keychain? You took the keys from me. Keychain knife. You know, we said that in a video. We need to do that. And there was like six of you guys just sent us a knife keychain in the mail. So we appreciate that. Yeah, we appreciate you. Let's cut this open right here and see what's in this big old box. Because I am really curious. Open up you. Slice and dice. Let's see. Uh, I opened it. And I still have no idea. <laughs> no clue. Metal pieces. 